What is the formation of Old English? English is a vast Germanic language that originated from the Anglo-Frisian dialects brought to Britain by Germanic invaders or settlers from various parts of what is now Northwest Germany and uh, the Netherlands. Initially, Old English was a diverse group of dialects reflecting the varied origin of the Anglo-Saxon kingdom of Britain. One of these dialects, late West Saxon, eventually became predominant. The English language underwent extensive change in the Middle Ages. Written Old English of AD 1000 is similar in vocabulary and grammar to other Old Germanic languages such as Old High German and Old Norse and completely unintelligible to modern speakers. While the modern language is already largely recognizable in written Middle English of AD 1400. The transformation was caused by two further waves of invention. The first by the speakers of the Scandinavian branch of the Germanic language family who conquered and colonized the parts of Britain in 8th and 9th centuries. The second by the Normans in the 11th century, who spoke Old Norman and ultimately developed an English variety of this called Anglo-Norman. A large proportion of the modern English vocabulary comes directly from Anglo-Norman. Close contact with the Scandinavian resulted in the significant grammatical simplification and lexical enrichment of the anglo frisian core of English. However, these changes had not reached the southwest England by the 9th century AD, where Old English was developed into a full-fledged literary language. The Norman invention occurred in 166. And when literary English rose anew in the 13th century, it was based on the speech of Lenten, much closer to the center of Scandinavian settlement. Technical and cultural vocabulary was largely derived from Old Norman, with particularly heavy influences in church, the courts, and government. With the coming of the Renaissance, as the most other developing European languages such as German and Dutch, Latin and Ancient Greek supplanted Norman and French as the main source of new words. Thus, English developed into very much a borrowing language with an enormously desperate vocabulary.